Chris Fiedmos, you ready to go? Uh, good, uh, good afternoon. My name is Anthony Weiner, Democratic candidate for mayor of the city of New York. Um, I have said that other texts and photos were likely to come out, and today they have. As I've said in the past, these things that I did were wrong and hurtful to my wife and caused us to go through many challenges in our marriage that extended past my resignation from Congress. While some of the things that have been posted today are true and some are not, there is no question that what I did was wrong. This behavior is behind me. I've apologized to my wife, Huma, and I'm grateful that he has, she has worked through these issues with me and that I've had her forgiveness. I want to again say how very sorry I am to anyone who has received the receiving end of these messages and the disruption that this has caused. And my wife, as I have said, my wife and I, as I've said, are moving forward together. Um, to some degree, with 49 days left until primary day, um, perhaps I'm surprised that more things didn't come out sooner. Uh, I'm responsible for this behavior that led us to be in this place. Um, but in many ways, things are not that much different than they were yesterday. This behavior that I did was problematic, to say the least, destructive, to say the most, caused many uh, stresses and strains in my marriage, but I'm pleased and blessed that she has given me a second chance. For the past several months, I've been asking New Yorkers to also give me another chance, to show them that I had a vision for the middle class and those struggling to make it and that I wanted to move forward. Um, it is perfectly reasonable for people to ask about this chapter in my life, to be curious about it, and I'm going to be there and try to answer those questions as best I can. Um, it is also perfectly understandable that all of you are doing your job being here in these great numbers, and I'm sure it's not just because of the mayoral forum we're going to have in a few minutes. Um, but all that being said, let me just reiterate um, to my wife how sorry I am that I, I did these things and um, how sorry I am to uh, the people that got these messages for any inconvenience or embarrassment they've caused. Um, now, some have asked the question, where does this fit in some timeline, some timeline of the continuum of the resignation? Look, the, the resignation was not a point in time that was nearly as important to my wife and me as the challenges in our marriage and the challenges of the things that I had done um, and working through them. Um, some of these things happened before my resignation. Some of them happened after. But the fact is that that was also the time that my wife and I were working through some things in our marriage. I'm glad these things are behind us. I know that this was a very public thing that we had happened to us, um, but by no means does it change the fundamentals of my, my feelings here, and that is that I uh, want to bring my vision to the people of the city of New York. I hope they're willing to still continue to give me a second chance, and I hope they realize that in many ways um, what happened today was something that frankly had happened before, but it doesn't represent all that much that is new. And now I have a chance to do something I haven't had a chance to do um, on the campaign yet, whom, as you know, has been out there with me recently, and uh, she had a few words that she wanted to say, so um, my amazing wife, Huma Abedin.